am I filming? Am I actually fi- Oh yeah, oh, oh wow, filming. Hey guys, welcome back. And we're just gonna make a house. We've got some people in here in a Skype call. So we're Hello. just- Hey. That is somebody, that is somebody else. I'm somebody else. Yeah. I'm, I'm the other some somebody else. I am not somebody. No. Nope. According to my mom. You're nobody. <laughs> <laughs> And I wanted to wait until I was filming to uh, build this here house. Uh, this is a dis is an awesome design, um, based off Ant Venom's peaceful map. I'm sure you'll recognize it when I actually get the big picture thing, Jake. But um, yeah, I was trying to find I was trying to find um, something that I'd be able to. to to yeah, do this. I'm trying to find the right number of blocks, and just by accident, it turns out I found it. So yeah, by accident. <laughs> by accident. Yeah, it just so <laughs> happened that the uh, dimensions I was using was perfect for this design. So I thought I'd use it. Originally, it was just going to be like a big glass tube. Um, I'm gonna ruin this. I I just know it. It's an accident waiting to happen. <laughs> I'm like silently counting in my head. Silently ish. Um I hope we've got enough wood for this. Great. Um I guess I actually forgot to mention that I have dug this down to bedrock. Uh, this uh, tunnel thing, and you can see it's curved as well. There's bedrock. He's a nice chap. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, you guys could probably see how that's turning out. It reminds me of cows. I have no idea why. Um, <laughs> I need a jacket or something because it's free. There are so many cows over here. Yeah, please don't kill them. Yeah, I, w I won't. I won't. They're my friends. Kill them. We hung out together. There goes, there goes Larry. So. <laughs> um, yeah, this has got to be several stories high before it starts to properly look. I'm going to turn down my render distance because I don't know why, but I think I might be starting to lag. Um, but yeah, uh, so this is what the house is gonna be like. This is just the start. Uh, I haven't, I don't know, uh, I've pretty much decided on what I want the outside to look like. The inside will be a lot different. It's gonna be kind of like a TARDIS. It's gonna be big, look bigger on the outside, but be bigger on the inside. You guys might be like, uh, you know, hey, nobody got time for that, but I got time for that. <laughs> um, I know how to do it because I'm an engineering occult genius, kind of. Ah, oh, sure you are. Oh, yeah, I've sure. got I've got actual people audience today. <laughs> <coughs> Funnily enough, these are the guys who aren't going to be watching the video. All yep. the other two million people <laughs> in the world are going to be watching it. <laughs> uh, I'll probably watch that. it just to hear my own voice. I'd probably watch it just to listen to his voice. <laughs> Ooh, really? <laughs> uh, uh oh, uh oh, oh. This is getting real. It is. Where yeah. the hell are you, Papa Timinus? Oh, you're killing cows. I told you not to. No, I didn't. I didn't. I didn't <laughs> kill a cow. I wasn't killing any cows. Oh, really? Because I saw like red stuff on it. There's red <laughs> stuff on your clothes. It was too. confetti. We were throwing a party. <laughs> well, no parties are gonna be thrown Besides, outside my your, house, bro. Your render distance is turned way low. You can't see. You can't oh, see. Oh, oh, oh! I, I, I can see. I can see <laughs> that you're killing all my cows. What? No. What cows? There are, no, cows? there are no cows here. <laughs> well, not now there aren't. <laughs> there were in the first place? Wow, that's a, hmm. it's a mystery. I wouldn't believe it. No, now. But, uh, 
There were once upon a time cows. Cows are free to roam here. And then along came a zombie ca called Bernie who claimed to be vegetarian, but actually loved beef. And he imprisoned the cows and he forced them to- Oh yeah, I guess I forgot to mention I made a wheat farm. That's just to, uh, just so I could breed my cows in case I needed food. And then I ended up making mushroom soup because I have some leftover mushrooms. So just made giant mushrooms. I have a lot of experience with giant mushrooms. How um, if, if, so, so you, if you have so much experience, then um, how do you um, I I like I've seen people plant mushrooms and make them be mushroom trees or whatever. What do you plant them on? You uh, plant them on dirt, but that's gonna be quite dark. And use bone meal. Uh, yeah, and you need to use bone meal. Oh, this is this is looking pretty good. Okay, I've I tried so that. And, like, uh, I've tried doing it. Well, I just don't, like, how is it supposed to be so dark if it's only, like, dark when there's a tree over it or something? Water nearby. Do it at night time. Do it in a cave without any torches. That's what I did to make my giant mushrooms. I just, it was here without, before I got rid of the roof. Um, and I made a giant mushroom. Mm -hmm. Okay, <laughs> I'll try that then. Chocolate rain. Chocolate ward. Some stay dry, and some others feel the pain. Um, you may wish to hide. Because there are going to be monsters here pretty soon. Yes, there are. But my house doesn't have a door, so I don't know where <laughs> you're going to hide. Hmm. <laughs> this is... This is going to end fabulously for me, isn't it? You guys are all don't dying worry. today. Well, if you'd like to uh, leave your possessions <laughs> somewhere where I can easily get them... Where is that ladder? Great. Oh my god! There is no ladder. <laughs> He's gonna steal your possessions. Oh, you better set that back right. Oh, I will. Oh, he will. Oh, he might. Oh, the the moon looks so cool in this texture pack. Awesome. Looks like the real moon. Oh, you're making a door. I don't want a door just, to go there. Just trying to get in. All right. Did you, Where? Did you, what are you doing down there? Are you right here? Yeah, right here. Here we go. Would All you right. guys like to sleep? Um, I'm not exactly in a position to sleep, but yeah, sure. I'll I'll do that. I'll just light it up up here. Not like with fire or anything, cause that could be bad. Here you go. This is the basic principle of my house. I'm just gonna pretty much do that, and then put a glass roof over it all. It's gonna be awesome, blood. Oh, awesome. I'm gonna get shot off here. Yeah, it's gonna be awesome. Uh, I just need to pretty much get some more wood. And I'll probably also add some glass windows. Uh, what what has he been doing over there tonight? Yeah, whatever. Ah! Uh, Do you want to put this wool in a chest or hand it to you? Uh, no, I'm coming down, so you can just hand it to me. Okay. Uh, eh, eh, I haven't been mining that out correctly. Eh, oops. I'll change that eventually. Oh, there's a creeper by my water source. Get away, creeper. Die. Um, but yeah, I think what I'm gonna do is, uh, just to do the floor off camera, because I don't really have time now, so. Uh, I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna finish that off off camera. I'm gonna change these edges a bit because that didn't really work. So yeah, um, I'll be back when that's all done. Boy, do I need food. See you in a bit. See ya. I'm saying bye to my viewers. Goodbye viewers, and I'll say bye to you guys in a <laughs> sec. Hey guys, welcome back. So I finally finished building our giant pillock here. You can see, well, cow shed pillock thing. Jig. <laughs> uh, it's probably not 
one of the best things to call it, whatever. It's a big tower, and it's awesome. It's pretty cool. Uh, I ran out of glass, but when I get some more, I'm gonna put some glass pane windows up here. Which should look pretty cool. I have this staircase, which is kind of a pain to go up and down. And I have fallen off a couple of times, but... Um... I haven't finished building this staircase yet. I am putting safety thing jig, safety rails... On eventually. And I have this kind of balcony up here. i got a glass roof here. Pretty cool. And then i got this balcony here. I'm not... Sh I can't say I like the look of it, though. Uh, as you can see, I've got this fountain here, with a hole in the middle, and the water goes down at the bottom. I can't say I like the look of that balcony. Uh, that's the entrance. Um, yeah, I'm not sure. I'm going to play around with that when I get the opportunity. But meanwhile, all the expansions have been going on downstairs. I'm starting the uh, outer ring now digging all this to bedrock and I noticed okay he's gone now so there's a slime down there oh wait no wait he's still there there's a slime down there we are this is actually in a slime chunk I'm gonna have the same problem as EB but luckily only my branch mines are gonna be there funnily enough my branch mine on rack also runs through a slime chunk um but slimes I've only ever seen slime there once or twice so not that bad. Uh, and I'm onto stone tools because I really ran out of iron. Although while I was making the second tier of that, oh yeah, let me. You can see the stairs are not very good. I'm gonna sort them out. But yeah, when I was making that second ring, the outer ring, if you like, the, I only made the inner ring just to get a, just as a start and also as a layout for the staircase. But yeah, so I found some more iron while making the outer ring. This guy's gonna be... Oh, it's a fail. Cheese. The lag. Alright. Cool. Well, that's the first time I've seen them around. I'm gonna try... I don't need to sleep particularly. I'm gonna try... Light up the surrounding areas as much as possible, I think. Uh, sorry. Uh, let me... Actually, no, sorry, as little as possible. I don't want a ton of slimes like EB had. I don't want the same problems as him with his slimes. So yeah, I just thought I'd show you that. Pretty cool. And I marked out these. These are the floors. Um, these are the floors that I'm going to make. And let me just get these away. So I have blocks, chest, blocks, staircases, and half slabs. I've got an everything else chest and then this diesel chests are all cobble chests you can see I've also got this down here I've also got just smooth stone everywhere down the bottom here so anyway yeah let me go through what all of these floors are so this is going to be a floor for branch mining this next one's also going to be a floor for branch mining yeah, so you know what let's use the this will be easier to use yeah. So first and second floor, they're both for branch mining. Um, third floor. This one is going to be a village. I'm going to make a, uh, a village here. I'm going to ship some over eventually. I'm I'm really planning ahead here. Um, but I'm going to ship some villagers over from the village I found. And if they're still alive, I don't know. Um, and the reason it's too thick is so I can have gravel roads then this one was gonna be cactus and sand farm I'm gonna have auto no, cactus and sand no cactus and reed farm I'm gonna have it automated which is why I made it so thick um, automatic I didn't really plan them so I can't say how thick it will be I just said I'll well, mark out all the floors from the top mark out all the floors from the bottom whatever space I have left I'll you make that the cactus and sugarcane farm but yeah that'll be automatic then got then this will be our pig cow uh chicken sheep and mushroom cow farm 
and the reason it's three deep isn't going to do what it did up there, the Zisto design. Um, it's three high, this bit so I marked out is three high, so that I can run around in there. Then three deep floor, that one is, that block over there is to separate it from the floor below, and then these two uh, areas to clear out for the cows and sheep and stuff. Then this one is... Oh, phew, I thought I was missing one. This one is uh, going to be my crop farm, my wheat, my sh uh, pumpkin, melon, wheat, pumpkin, melon, uh, carrot and potato when I get some. I have some carrots, but I don't have any potatoes. So that's going to be what that is. And finally, this big one here is going to be a tree farm. The reason it's so tall is I'm going to be growing all four types of trees here. And I need the extra space for the um, jungle trees and the, sp the dark wood. And then this final floor here, which you can't really... Ah, crap. That's gross. The final floor here, which you can't really see marked out because I've been clearing all this out. This is going to be our storage room, portal room, furnace room, and enchanting room. So I've planned well ahead here. Uh, yeah, why, why does that look yellow? Oh, I don't know, it's just being weird like that. Um, but yeah, uh, so thank you for watching. I know this has been kind of a short episode. I, as I said before, I tried to keep my episodes to about 15 minutes long. Uh, because I think that's the perfect length, but normally I end up going over to around 25 minutes, so yeah, this I believe is about 15 to 20 minutes, but 15 to 20 minutes is kind of my target for all of my episodes. So yeah, once again, thank you for watching, and I'll see you, I don't know when the next update on my progress here will be. And you can see, I don't like the stair design either. Uh, I'm going to replace these with stairs, with stairs as well. So I'll have corner stairs. Um, yeah, that's that. Yeah, excuse me. That's that. And I'll see you guys when I next have something to show. Um, I'm pretty much spending all my time on this base, and then we'll do something like branch mining or something once I've finished doing what I want to do to the base. It makes sense to branch mine before I make the base uh, just so I can get resources to mine with. I haven't found any diamonds yet uh, and also I'm kind of low on iron. But the reason I haven't already done that is so I can plan out the floors for the branch mine. I mean I, I've got them here and here but just just generally planning them out but yeah thank you for watching and hello and i'll see you see you all